Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another YouTube, well, uh, where, TubeBuddy tutorial. TubeBuddy, yeah, we're on TubeBuddy tutorial. Today we're going to talk about the Video Topic Planner. Jeffrey Powers here from Geekazine, Think Magazine, Put in the Geek. Yeah, you got me. You can find me Twitter, Geekazine, Geekazine.com, Geekazine at Gmail, you know, all the, uh, all the good stuff. And today we're going to talk about planning because I'm going to tell you something. When I plan topics, it, it gets tough uh, to sometimes do that because I'm, you know, I, I'm one person crew and, and I'm trying to get all this stuff. I got reviews that I've got to get out. I've got stuff that I do on other people's channels that I've got to get out, you know, projects that, you know, I get paid to do those projects. So I do that. And so, you know, there's a point where it's like you get overwhelmed or, or it's like, what do I do? Or you get stalled. Perfect example. Today I was doing, a, uh, I was getting ready to do a review video. I ran into a snag and in the snag, I had to contact the company and say, Hey, look, this is what it's, what it's doing. This is what you say it does. What's true. And I'm waiting for uh, confirmation back. But because of that, I can't do this video now. So I kind of have to put it back on the shelf. So now it's like, well, what do I put for a video? Because I want to get more content out. Last couple of weeks, I haven't been putting out content as much. I need to do more. So what I want to do, is, what I decided to do was, well, I'll try this feature that I've been trying, that I wanted to try for a long time. It uh, helps me plan what I'm going to do for videos. Now, this is through, through TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is a third-party service for YouTube that you can you pay for it but it gives you a whole bunch of great stuff. You can get it over at TubeBuddy.com forward slash geek, TubeBuddy.com forward slash geek. Of course, that is an affiliate code. And of course, it helps me keep the lights on here. Thank you very, very much. And what is it? It's an addition to YouTube. So when you see, when you get to your videos, when you're looking at your comments and stuff like that, you can do things a lot easier. It adds the third party, uh, third party TubeBuddy in several different places. So you can do things like for instance, if I wanted to, I can bulk copy my my templates. I can uh, or annotations. I can bulk copy my cards. Uh, so it, when I when I load up a video such as this one, those cards I can just put them right in and go from there. I can do caption service, search rankings, tag trends, and and I've done this. I I've actually been doing a lot of these videos. It's in a playlist for TubeBuddy tutorials. You can uh, look at that, and of course I'll have the link down in the show notes. Um, and, uh, of course, animated GIF generator, thumbnail generator, advanced embed, all this other stuff. But today we're going to take a look at this up here. And this is called the Video Topic Planner. And like I said, this is where if you say, hey, I need, I need topics, I need to figure out something, or I need to start planning. Like, for instance, uh, you know, I've got this now, I got a, 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 this interesting, it's a Moto Edition. It's actually a projector that goes onto a phone. So I can actually put this in here and start working on it. So when it's time to do the video, I have the notes at my fingertips here. Um, and of course, if I have no ideas of what I'm going to do, I can go through some of the trending and some of the comment suggestions. I'll show you how to do that and get some better ideas so I can make some more videos. So here, here it is. It's pr pretty uh, simple. We can add a topic straight up. Like for instance, I can say Moto Projector. And I can hit, hit add and it's added right there here. And so with this, I can actually uh, create my title. I can put in my notes. I can save all the changes or I can delete the topic altogether. When I want to do another topic, I just hit add topic and I come in here. Now let's take a look at what's trending. We've got Doriel Green Beckham, who uh, who was traded to the Eagles. Um, something to do with Selena Gomez and Justin Bieber. Um, Google, Google Duo, which is their new phone FaceTime type app. Um, and you know, stuff like that. So we can go down here, we can find stuff that pertains to what we would do for our YouTube videos. If we don't see anything here, we can find what's trending for a topic. So I can go, let's say I want to go Pokemon go let's let's, or just, let's just do Pokemon. Let's explore what's going on in Pokemon land because Pokemon go is pretty popular right now. Uh, we've got Pokemon sun and moon, which is a separate game X, Y, and Z Pokemon sun, uh, Pokemon shuffle. Uh, Dave Lafarge Pokemon. So we've got some some ideas here, and we can do uh, all the searches. If we hit this plus, we add it as a topic, and then we can uh, cultivate that from there. Now, comment suggestions. This is actually really cool because sometimes you get comments that are like, "Okay, I need to do a video on that." And like for instance, we'll take this one right here. I did a video on large diaphragm microphones, USB microphones, 
And this person said, I loved it. It's a very informative breakdown. I'm currently using a Blue Spark Digital. I'm thinking to myself, hmm, maybe I should tr talk to the people at Blue Spark Digital and maybe do a review of that. So what I'm going to do is go down to the TubeBuddy thing right here. I'm going to press on this. And it's going to say, now I have my canned response. It says, hey, you rock. So saying that I've read your, your, uh, your message. I already uh, replied to it, so I don't have to do it again. But I can also choose this add comment suggestion. So I check this. So now it's checked. I can go up here, back into my video topic planner. I can go add topic. I can go comment suggestions. And for some reason, it didn't show up. I think it's because I did this already. Maybe it it's, it's, thinks that I've already done it. Let's try it again. That might be a little glitch right there. So let's let's do the next one here because we just want this as a good idea. So we're going to hit this. Oops. Add is comment suggestion. And then we're going to go up here. And we're going to go into the video topic planner. Add topic. There we go. Comment suggestions. So there must be a little glitch. I'll have to uh, let TubeBuddy know. I'll get a, we'll, they'll get it fixed. Not a problem. So, so, um, so it, uh, it doesn't look, the comment doesn't look great. But the whole idea is I could say, okay, um, movie free, free movie apps. So I get the idea. So I go, okay, let's add this. We're going to add this right here. And we'll hit add. And that'll create this. So I can change this title to free movie apps. And the best part is I can sit here and I can uh, look at these notes. I can add this. So now when I do the video, I can say, hey, this person commented on my site and he said, why well, pay for an app that has the same movies as free apps have? So what free apps are out there? Hey, that's a great idea. Let's, let's do a video on that. And now I've got that information in there. I can incorporate it in my notes. So when it's time to do the YouTube video, boom, I've got that information right there. And of course, if I feel that this is going absolutely nowhere, you see the source right there is, is from Michael. So if this, uh, if this is going nowhere and, and uh, yeah, I, I just don't feel like the video is working right and I want to get rid of it, I just hit the delete topic, say OK, and it's gone. I can do the same thing with this and say OK, and it's gone. And I'm back to the video topic planner. It's a great way for you to kind of put everything together, keep it in one area. And of course, if other people access that YouTube channel, you, you can collaborate on that so you can find out, uh, you can have ideas. So if, you know, if you got a team of three or four, you got those ideas in one area, which is really nice. So once again, it's really simple. Uh, once you get the TubeBuddy app and you can download it, you can get it. Uh, it's, uh, the, you can use it for really quick. They have, you have free samples there. When you're ready to uh, be part of it, you just have to go to the price plan and, and choose which price plan you want. And of course, once again, if you go over to TubeBuddy.com, forward slash geek to buddy.com forward slash geek. You can, uh, you can get that. And of course that's my affiliate code. So basically what you do to buddy video topic planner, add your topics, find out what's trending, do some, uh, figure out your comment suggestions. So somebody else could be uh, scoring through the comments and say, Hey, let's talk about this one and then come back and go from there. And then of course you've got YouTube videos. You're ready to go. And you're not sitting there twiddling your thumbs, figuring out what, what the next thing is going to be. So that is that. Hopefully that helps you, especially if you've got TubeBuddy. What do you think about it? Let me know. You can tweet me over at Geekazine or Geekazine at gmail.com. That has been this tutorial on how to uh, use the video topic planner TubeBuddy has to offer. If you want to see some of the other videos that I have, uh, there is the playlist for TubeBuddy that will be down in the link below. You guys geek out. We'll see you next time and take 